Hi, this is Neil Good with the Good Law Group. Today I'm going to be talking about signs that your case has been approved. Now, these aren't guarantees, but they usually are indications that things are going pretty well. So the first couple are obvious. I mean, if you get a fully favorable decision from an ALJ, then that means your case was approved. The other obvious one is if you get a letter from the Social Security Administration and saying you've been medically approved and they have to do some other, you have to find out some other information and all the information you've previously given them is accurate. Specifically, very often they're looking to make sure you've worked exactly when you said you worked so you have enough credits to qualify. Some of the not obvious um, ways to know that you've been approved is at a hearing, and these aren't guarantees, but at a hearing, if there's a medical expert and the medical expert says that you medically equaled or met a listing, then, you know, only one time um, have I ever had a judge then basically disagree with the medical expert and say they were wrong. And that's because these are the people they hire and they're a little bit biased, I think, toward um, the Social Security Administration. Another way that sometimes you can tell if you've been approved is at the hearing, if the judge doesn't ask the vocational expert any questions, then that's often a good sign because that means that they've already determined there are no jobs you can do. Another sign that isn't as often, but what happens is if you're at the application or consideration level, and all of a sudden they call you and tell you on and call you on the phone and they ask start asking you financial questions like uh, do you have more than two thousand dollars in savings uh, what is your rent payment how do you get that money that's often a very good sign but one thing I would tell everybody is that very often they not they call you and they say um, you've been approved and something comes up so I always tell my clients until we have it in writing we don't have it for sure so when they tell you on the phone, that isn't as much a guarantee as when you get it in writing. Thank you for listening today. I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, you can contact us at the information provided below.